What's up guys? All right, so we left off last time working on the front grill here and I couldn't find the nuts for these and this is the mounting point the one that we made But so I went out And I got some new ones, so we're gonna get this mounted today and hopefully get this body pulled to the right spot for the grills gonna be so let's get started take a look so we got this mounted now she's on there but we got quite a bit of room here it looks like we could probably slide the engine more forward but we're gonna see so we're gonna you know prop that up maybe get a strap on it we're gonna try to lower this down right on top Seems to be pretty good. All right, so we got it. Got the body lowered down, and even the latches right here. Look at they latch in nicely. Might have to push it forward a little bit more. We have a slight gap. Actually, it's not that bad. There we go. So pretty good location. I'm happy with that. I'm happy the way. Well, first, I'm going to see where the fenders are going to go. That's what we're going to work on next. That's a good spot. Body looks like a good spot. The engine, not too bad. Might have to move, push forward. I don't think no more back, but forward, I'm pretty sure. So right now, time to work on the fenders. Time to see if the fender fits. <laughs> So it looks like the fender looks to be about in a pretty good spot. I don't know, maybe slightly forward. I got to look at other other people's trucks to kind of see exactly where it should be. And I got to look at the, the original truck to see exactly where, where it is. But all in all, that's not bad. Remember, I'm going to be putting probably 40s on this truck. And these are like 30s, you know, so... We're gonna get some big tires. I got 35s or 37s sitting in the back. So I might slap them on and see what it looks like. But right now, look at that. Even where the fender hits. I mean, got a little gap here, but we gotta cut this bracket and slide it in. And build a whole new bracket, so. And when we do that, it's gonna raise this up a little bit more. That's gotta go back a little more. So we'll see, but. Well, look at that, one's on. All right, so I decided that I wanna slide the body back. Check out this new blade I got. Look at this thing. It's a diamond blade, but it's for cutting steel. I had one in the past, they worked pretty good. And I don't know what happened to it. Stopped working, I lost it. Don't remember. So we're gonna give it a shot right now to cut these tack welds right off. <laughs> Alright, so now we want to slide that either. I might drill new holes, weld these holes solid, and I might extend this plate as well. So I might probably do something like that, and we're gonna extend the plate. 
which is no big deal. We're just gonna extend it out. All right, so we gotta extend this back about four, we gotta extend this piece about four inches. So first, make that a little curve so we can attach it. Then, four inches is a little longer than I need it, but I'm, I think that'll do it. And then we can always cut it later. You know, you can always cut it shorter. Got new glasses. Give it a shot. They're for torchin too, so we're good. They're not that great. Still kinda not good. Oh good. We go with that. Send that out. Should be good. Let's make another. Alright, so now let's weld these pieces together. Let's do it. We got the piece. See, we extended it. Not bad. Let's see how it fits. If we get to there. Bam. So we're gonna tack that on. We might have to shorten it, but I left it a little bit long just to just to make sure, you know. All right, second try. We're gonna install the grill and see if everything lines up. Time to reinstall the fender and check the fitment. See if it works. All right. So I think the fitment is definitely better. Like I said, we're going to be putting big tires. These are small ones, so. Look at that gap back there. That's a good gap now. It's pretty uniform. And now we, the front of the axle, or so the center of the axle, lines up about right there, which I think is a good spot, good location. Like I said, we're putting some massive tires on this thing. So that's the location I'm sticking with. I think it looks good. And that's it. Now it's time to do, now it's time to weld this solid and fix the grill and make mounting points for the fender down there and everywhere else you know we got to do all that stuff but that's next so let's do it all right so we got the plate down here we got it all welded in now so we're good so that grill is mounted i mean i only got one nut in there and i got a strap holding it back but Pretty sure this is the good location. Everything looks good. It's lined up. I might have to slide the engine forward because look, look where that engine is. That thing is way too far back. My feet got to go here, you know? But I got to see how many radiators and how much stuff is going to go in there. We're going to find out real soon. But done for today, and I will see you guys tomorrow.